Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, this is a really small one. This is what it looks like from above, but I guess that's not how you would experience it. Where's the fog settings? There's no fog settings in default Minecraft. I guess let's experience this how it should be experienced. In a creative world where I go into survival. Ooh. Whoa, what is this place? This is a creepy atmosphere. I don't have a shield. That's what I'm missing. I'm looking for something creepy. Or should I say creaky? Okay. First impressions, it is <laughs> it's it's so silly to see them slide when you look when they're back in your in your line of sight. Like I feel like it just needs to completely freeze. Like you shouldn't be able to see it move at all. But yeah, that slide. <laughs> it's so I don't know. You're kind of cute, bro. It should just pause like mid animation, mid walk cycle. It should just be like Also, am I crazy? I don't hear any Oh. That's why. That's so cool. It should just stop. It should <laughs> But it's I like the texture. I like the model. That's so awesome. Knock it off. Just Dude, fucking teaming on me. Okay, what if it could climb trees? Hot take, they should be able to climb trees and they should have a terrifying fucking climbing animation. Like those mods that add those freaky ass, you know what I'm talking about, where they crawl. That might be too much for like a six year old playing this game. Oh, it's night and there's this scary biome. I could just... Okay, I'm getting shot. This skeleton's trying to prove me wrong. But I could just go up here and be like, home free. Where's the creaking? It can't even get to me. I feel like the creaking's pathfinding capabilities should be a little more advanced. So what is this? This, look, this spider is doing a better job. So yeah, it's definitely lacking in aura. I made a tweet about how they should make the trees taller and how they should add like biome specific fog. And that might be outside of the scope of what they're trying to achieve with this little drop. But that would be so cool. My feedback when the Minecraft live happened was that the trees should be like taller to match the creaking. This is a, I mean, it's a relatively thin mob, but I can see now how it's like modeled after the dark oak trees. Lore wise, it's definitely just like a corrupted dark oak biome. So it makes sense why it's like just reskin dark oak trees. I mean, there's intention behind it, so it's not lazy in my eyes, but I just feel like there should be a little more character to the trees that separates them. Like it's just the bark kind of changes how it looks. The leaves change how they look and then they grow some vines, but I feel like they could do more with it. And then Pale Garden, the name seems to imply that there would be more foli- like there's a lot of foliage. Don't get me wrong, but like flowers, imagine these are white. And then every now and then, like an orange flower to like trip you up. You think you see the eyes of the creaking. Some spores, some pale spores that release some eerie particles. Maybe not green, maybe like white moss particles. I mean, already this place looks fucking badass. Maybe it was less pink but and i have my render distance set to two chunks for the fog and there still isn't the fog they ruined minecraft fog like fog it it just fades out the edge of your render distance it, it used to be like it would start much closer to you and that's that was like the feel of alpha like the hero brine image what made that so cool was in part thanks to the fog and we just don't have that anymore and i feel like they need to step up their game in that department. Um, that was a change that never should have been made and the art department needs to really uh, lock in on the atmospherics. That's why it was upsetting when the fireflies weren't added. Like yeah, it's two pixels. Like it sounds kind of ridiculous to complain about that, like not getting that, but it was, it's little things like that. They add up and add 
like give feeling like it makes this place feel tangible like if there are fireflies flying around and maybe that you look at them and you're like oh shit you think it's like the eyes of the creaking but oh it's just fireflies and you continue i saw this person make a post before the minecraft live because they they leaked that there was going to be a, like something called the pale gardens so they made their interpretation of what that name would be in game and they made a forest in a cave and they had like the fog and like logs on the ground and it was just so cool by the way i love this wood set i love this this looks so good and it's gray it's uh, it's gray but it's a it's a a little bit of a colder actually it might be a little redder than acacia interesting this is like marbly like i saw this on tmg's twitter if i go in here i want to see if it actually works because this wasn't available to us when they tweeted it. So I just can't escape. Here, <laughs> give myself a diamond pick. Oh my god. Okay, I can dig up here. What happens if I... Okay. So you're just stuck here until daytime. <laughs> That's so awesome. You can't break the top. You can place water. So you just kind of have to stare at it till daytime. Unless you know another way to get out. That's fun. I like that. I don't know if I actually like that. Also, I saw this on Twitter. From... Sided Squ eight Sided Square. An account called Eight Sided Square. When you look at it, it sinks. What fun. Eyesight detection things. That's cool. Bitzel merch is back. It never technically left, but I haven't promoted it since I first promoted it back in like 2019. It's here. I just made a poster for the, F the Phantom video for the two-year anniversary of the Phantom video. And it's awesome. And if you want it, it's go for it. Bye-bye.